breaking news, UK Prime Minister Boris Johnson has announced his plans to restart the economy and ease lockdown restrictions in England. But how could everyday life change? Can more people go back to work? From Wednesday, people in England who can't work from home will be actively encouraged to go to work. The government had earlier indicated this would apply for Monday, but they should still avoid public transport if possible because of social distancing. And the government says it is working on guidance for employees to make workplaces COVID secure. Previous draft government proposals to bring UK business out of lockdown suggest hot desking would no longer continue. Companies will also need to look at staggering shifts, rethink how equipment is shared and plans safe, walking routes for staff in offices on factory floors and at building sites. The issue of how businesses can secure personal protective equipment without competing with the NHS has raised concerns. And unions say employees must be compelled so to protect staff. When will schools and universities return? Mr Johnson says primary schools in England may be ready to reopen in stages, but not until 1st of June at the earliest. This could begin with reception, year one and year six pupils going back. The Prime Minister also says it's the government's ambition to give secondary school pupils doing exams next year at least some time with their teachers before the summer holidays. The Welsh Government has ruled out school reopenings happening on the 1st of June. Scotland's First Minister, Nicola Sturgeon, said she does not expect schools to be reopening as soon as the 1st of June. No detail is available on how school reopening would work in England, but there has been speculation previously that measure, measures to keep pupils and teachers safe could include limiting class sizes, groups of pupils attending on different days, redesigned classrooms, staggered break times. Meanwhile, there is uncertain, uncertainty over whether students will be able to go to university in person in September or whether they will be taught partially or completely online. Can you meet friends and relatives? The new guidelines are expected to say, say that two people from different households would be able to meet in outdoor settings like parks as long as they stay more than two metres apart. Will people be able to exercise more? From Wednesday, people in England will be able to spend more time outdoors for leisure purposes. They can take, they can take more and even unlimited amounts of outdoor exercise. Rather than only exercising once a day, people will also be free to sit in parks and be able to play sports with people from the same household. It will also be possible for households to drive to other destinations such as parks and beaches in England but social distancing rules, keeping at least two metres away from other people outside your household, must still be followed. And Culture Secretary Oliver Downden says sports like golf, basketball, tennis and fishing will now be possible for people in the same household. The Welsh and Scottish governments have said people can exercise outdoors more than once a day for Monday. How will the coronavirus threat be publicised? A COVID alert system with a level of danger rated 1 to 5, 5 being the most critical, will be introduced, Mr Johnson said. This will determine how tough social distancing measures need to be. The lower the number, the more they will be relaxed and vice versa. The UK, the UK is currently at level 4. When can I go shopping again? The Prime Minister says the phased reopening of shops, other than food stores and other essential outlets, may begin in England on the 1st of June at the earliest. This will only happen where social distancing rules can be followed. Garden centres in Wales will open from Monday. Decisions are awaited in Scotland and Northern Ireland. Mis Mr Johnson made no mention of garden centres in England in his speech. Some DIY stores, meanwhile, have already reopened but they are accepting card payments only and have shorter trading hours. But our number, what it means and why it matters. Air travellers, the new quarantine rules. Look up tool, how many cases are in your area. Recovery, how long does it take to get better? What about pubs, cafes, restaurants, theatres and cinemas? Mr Johnson says the government hopes to reopen at least some sort of hospitality. Some of the hospitality industry 
and other public places in England, but this will happen later than for shops and schools. By July at the earliest, this will also depend on scientific advice and the possibility of keeping to social distancing measures. Draft government guidance news has said bar areas, seated areas in restaurants and cafes must remain closed, even as if the company is opened up and venues should serve takeaways only. Will taking flights get easier? Mr Johnson says it will, seen by the time, with coronavirus transmission rates fall, fall, falling to impose quarantine on people coming to the UK by air. No more detail was given to in Mr Johnson's speech on what form this quarantine would take or how it would be enforced. Overall, social distancing is a big challenge for airports and airlines, with Heathrow boss John Holland K saying it's probably impossible. Easy jet plans to leave middle seats empty, but Ryanair boss Michael O'Leary says this would be idiotic. There has been speculation that air passengers may have to wear masks on flights, arrive up to four hours before departure for health screening, walk through thermal imaging cameras. The UK airlines say they have been told by the government that people arriving in the UK from any country other than the Republic of Ireland from the end of this month will have to self-isolate for 14 days. Mr Johnson did not give this much detail in his speech. Trade body airlines said such a move would effectively kill air travel. Meanwhile, the government has said people should not book holidays at home or abroad until social distancing rules are relaxed. News reporter Dwayne Hards, MK Local News and Awareness UK 3.